Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see that what is environment in Power Platform. In general, you might have faced the issue that you might have seen that you are not assigned to any environment in a Power Platform or maybe some users are not able to see the environment in Power Platform to which they might needs to be assigned. So in this video, I am going to tell you that how you can assign the license, how you can assign the security group, and finally, how you can assign the security role to number of users so that they can see the particular environment which is intended to see. So first, let's understand that what is the concept of environment. Environment can have zero or one, one Microsoft Dataverse database. So either there could be no Dataverse database in your environment or there could be at max one Dataverse database available in the environment. And the process of adding the users to that environment, having no Dataverse database, it differs from the other process for environments that have the Dataverse database. So let's see this in more details. So let's say there is a user and who reports that I cannot see the environment. So first of all, we have to check that whether a particular uh, license is assigned to that user or not. So the first and foremost step to troubleshoot whether a user is assigned to an environment in Power Platform is to check whether that user is assigned a license or not. So let's say you cannot see the user in environment uh, user list. So first you have to assign the license in the Microsoft 365 admin center to that particular user. Once the, and, uh, once the license is assigned to that user, then we have to set up the security groups. You have to set up the security groups for that environment. Make sure that the user is assigned to that particular security group. And if it is not assigned, then you have to check whether is it an environment with a database or without a database. If it is with us with a Dataverse database, then that user needs to have the environment admin or environment maker security role. If the, if the environment is without Dataverse database, then user at least needs to have the environment maker role, security role. Once all these steps are done, then the user should now be able to see the environment. Now let's see this in action in M365 Admin Center and Power Platform Admin Center, how it looks like. So currently I am in Microsoft 365 Admin Center. You can see on my screen, there is a user, let's say called Lee. So first of all, as the first step, as I told you earlier, that the first step is to assign the license to the user. In M365 Admin Center, you can see for this user, Power Apps and Power Automate license is already assigned. It means a Power Platform license is assigned to this user. So this is the step number one. Now the next steps, what you can uh, check in your Power Platform environment is that click on the environment. It will take you to the environment details. And here you can see security group. And on the right hand side, you can see the security role. As of now in my environment, the security group is not assigned. I will tell you why. And then there are security roles also. So if you click on security roles, you can see here number of roles which are available in the environment. Right now, uh, let's go to the official documentation of Microsoft, which talks about the security groups. So this is the official documentation control user access to environment power platform environment security groups and licenses. Some important points are given here, which we can uh, have a look. When users are added to the security group, they are added to the environment directly. And when users are removed from the security group, they are disabled in the environment. So these are some of the important points which are given on the Microsoft documentation. <coughs> important thing which I wanted to show you is security groups cannot be assigned to the default or developer environment types. So in my environment, uh, I am currently using the default environment. That's why I cannot assign any security group to this particular environment. It is very clearly mentioned in the Microsoft documentation. You can see the users, what all users are there in the Power Platform environment. So if you click on users, you can see all the users which are part of this environment. And if I click on my name, for example, Bipul, we can see that what all different roles are assigned to this particular user. You can see here approval user, environment maker, system administrator, and so on. So these are the roles, security roles, which needs to be assigned 
to the particular users or individual users. So that's all in this video. In this video, I have showed you that how you can uh, assign the license to a particular user. You have to first create the security group for that environment and then you have to assign the security role to the users. Depending on the environment, whether the, your environment has a Dataverse database or your environment does not have a Dataverse database. That's all in this video. Thank you.